Between our senior White House correspondent, Cecilia Vega. Cecilia, we saw that announcement from Vladimir Putin ramping up the readiness of his nuclear forces. The White House trying to downplay it. Yeah, George, exactly. Good morning to you. The White House really trying to dial down some of this rhetoric they're hearing. They say these words from Putin were escalatory and unnecessary. But right now, what we are seeing from this White House and Western allies, they are really ramping up the pressure on Moscow in recent days. They are responding directly to those Ukrainian pleas for more weapons to fend off those Russian planes and helicopters. The White House approving that 300, more than $350 million defense package. This now includes that first batch of surface to air missiles that the Ukrainians had been asking. And this is big. Germany also reversing its historic policy to not send lethal aid to conflict zones. It's now going to allow, it's now going to send those weapons to Ukraine. We are also seeing, George, what could be the most strict, the strictest sanctions ever levied in modern history from these Western nations and the White House. They're going after Russia, rich Russians, freezing their assets, targeting their yachts, their mansions, their luxury apartments. They're even, even trying to go after their ability to send their children to fancy schools here in the West. And on those sanctions, they are now cutting Russia off from that SWIFT banking system. This is important because it allows, it, that, that's the system that helps large banks transfer money internationally. And this could really hurt uh, Russia's ability to do much of its business beyond its borders. But the big ones going after Russia's central bank, this is targeting that some $600 billion in rainy day funds that Russia had set aside to sanction proof its economy. So George, really what we're seeing right now, they are going after the oligarchs, they're going after Putin himself. And a lot of these moves could end up hurting the Russian economy in general, and that's going to have Putin facing political backlash at home, George. Yeah, the Western response really accelerated over the weekend. Okay, Cecilia, thanks. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.